Hi everybody, it's the Soap Man and it's time to make the second batch of soap this week. I'm not testing this fragrance, I've used it before, but I have a small bottle to do a small batch. It's Espresso from Brambleberry. This smells just like, I mean, I just can't tell you how good this smells. Like you want to take a drink from the bottle, which obviously you can't, but that's how good it smells. This darkens to a very dark brown, but I like to go ahead, as do most people, and darken it anyway with something stable it's going to make it even and stable so i'm using nurture soaps mocha brown that will represent the coffee i'm going to just drizzle in some white using titanium dioxide and then i'll pipe some white piping on the top to represent uh, some cream on top of your espresso so anyway real simple soap it should be so let me get things set up and i'll be back okay i'm ready so this obviously, as we've mentioned, is color, so I'm going to go ahead and put some mocha brown in here. It's one tablespoon, which should be enough. That just goes ahead and makes it brown to start out with, and it's even. And even if it were if it would naturally darken to brown on its own, um, it wouldn't happen immediately. It wouldn't happen when I cut it. So most soapers, myself included, like to just go ahead and make our batter brown. That way we can get it the brown we want. Okay. Now I am going to get my white mixed up first because Brambleberry says this fragrance accelerates. I've used it, but it was years ago, and I do not remember accelerating. So, I want to mix the white first anyway. So, I went ahead and put my titanium dioxide in there, dispersed in hot water. to go. Now let's see how our fragrance does. I know I can use roughly half of this bottle and it doesn't have to be precise. I'm well within safety ranges using about half. And oh gosh that smells good. Oh it smells so good. All right now I'm not seeing anything weird happening. go ahead and stick blend it because my heart is setting up. With all that TD, it has a lot of titanium dioxide in it. So I am going to go ahead and hit this with the stick blender. It's thickening a little bit. Now I don't see anything to be concerned with. I didn't remember accelerating in years past. Now I'm going to go ahead and pour all of the brown in and scrape the container. Clean it out. white in while we still can. It's still pourable. Oh yeah. So I'm going to drop this in and I am going to go ahead and hanger swirl it to make it a little fancier. No, that brown's still nice and fluid.
And that is going to have to set for quite a while before I even mix up the soap frosting. So I will be back. soap and the pour went really well which I knew it would really simple the frosting where I didn't have fragrance took forever to set up and I thought it would set up quickly because it had a ton of titanium dioxide in it and I stick blended it heavily but it was really gloopy when it came out and then I guess when it hit the hot oven it kind of collapsed and deflated so anyway we'll see it smells great oh man it smells good but let's cut it and see Okay, I'm trying to get this lined up. That should about do. It seems like it's really hard to get it to break through that first layer, and then once it gets started, it's okay. I'm um, not sure it's going to do it. I think I was cutting melt and pour. Okay, I'll be back. I think it's the frosting is so hard because it has so much titanium dioxide in it because I finally broke through. I gouged the sides. Wow. Yeah, the frosting is just hard as a brick. Oh, but looks at look at the inside. Very nice. Yeah, that's just exactly what I expected. Just wasn't expecting rock hard frosting on top. And I don't see a browning edge on the on the outside, so that tells me that that's as dark as it's going to get because of the mic I put in it. But 
But yeah, other than a hard time cutting it, that's exactly what I planned. See the gouge I put in the side? Yeah, I like that. It smells fantastic. This fragrance is just, ooh, it's so good. So there we have it. Really pleased with this. And I'll see you all next week for some more soap. So thanks for watching, everybody. Stay safe, take good care of yourselves, and be blessed. Bye.